nice here today. Um, more snow has melted away. The sun's out, but it still isn't that warm yet. I mean, warm enough to be a sloppy mess. We got the backhoe out here today. Um, I started pushing. This is our compost pile or compost area um, where we compost our manure from the barn. And then after it gets composted for a few years, really for a few years, we end up leaving it. Um, then we go through and we spread it on certain fields, you know, as we need it. So you can see our pile starts all the way back there by the tree and comes all along in here. So about to here is um, old enough to go ahead and it's been sitting long enough to go ahead and spread. The stuff here in the front where you can see I've been, I started making a mess here and, and piling back up. This was stuff like from this winter. So um, you can kind of see what it looks like over here. Here's a bunch of little piles. So like as the spreader comes down, um, I bring, I bring the spreader up here, we empty it, and then we make a bunch of little piles. And it's hard in the winter time, these little piles will be frozen solid after, so I can't continually push them into the big pile. So I have to spread them out into all these little piles, and then like now, you know, springtime or whatever, I come back, that's what was over here, was a bunch of little piles. And I'm bringing that all down in, and we're gonna make one big pile here again, and then we'll let this sit for a while uh, before we use it. So. Um, so that's today's project. We're going to take the rest of this and bring it over here, push it back there. And then the other thing we're going to do, because things are still a little bit frozen, I want to get this spread here sometime soon. So we're going to take the, uh, the backhoe and we're just going to take it and we're going to kind of rip the top off of this pile so that the sun can get in there and make sure that everything towards the center of the pile uh, can thaw out a little bit so we don't have big chunks because you know we can't spread big frozen chunks uh, of compost in our spreader so that's what we're going to be doing um, I'll get you set up here and let's get started
right, sorry the wind is getting bad out here. If it it inter interferes with the uh, the camera, the sound there a little bit. I'm trying to block it, but here's a up close kind of what the compost looks like. Um, this is, like I said, a couple of years old now. Been sitting around. So pretty good looking stuff, nice and dark. It'll be a nice addition to the fields. We do have some spots that... Uh, will need uh, you can just tell they're low in organic matter as compared to some of the other spots so that's the spots that we'll be kind of concentrating on um, spreading the compost so the pile here is only uh, you can't quite see the whole thing it's only about 100 feet long I think it was about five feet tall roughly it wasn't quite as frozen as I thought it was going to be but there's some big chunks I don't know if you can see that one standing up right there that's one big chunk there so the sun will be able to get in there now make sure everything's fairly thawed out so we'll be able to start spreading um, there's that wind start spreading in a week or two so uh, we're going to go clean the machine up a little bit here this is a job for the backhoe not the skid steer because that just would get stuck down there in that muck so we're going to go clean this up and uh, that is the end of this project so thanks for watching. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, give us a, a thumbs up. And uh, if you want to subscribe, hang around a while, see if there's some other stuff that, uh, that you might like. Uh, we appreciate it. Uh, any comments, questions, leave it down below. And we'll see you guys on the next video.